Hey, what's going on, everyone? This is Dan Bennett, the Antipreneur. This is another quick, down and dirty, hurry it up tutorial. And today we're working in Adobe Illustrator. Let's get to the screen. Okay. So I'm working on some artwork for the Antipreneur Show podcast because every time we put out social media, I put out a little animation that's included with it. Today we have a light bulb and a brain. We're working on an episode about creativity. So I put this light bulb off to the side of my artboard for a very specific reason because today we're talking about alignment, okay? So the first thing I'm gonna do is select the brain, hold shift, select the light bulb so they're both selected. Come up here and choose align to selection. Now when I come back up and choose center, they're going to align to each other. So you see that that space in between them was covered as they both align to the selection that I had. I had both objects selected, boom, they come to the center. Now that's great because they're now centered, but my light bulb moved. And like I said earlier, I had it off to the side on purpose. I don't want it to move. That's exactly where I want it to be. So back to the board, control Z, we're gonna undo that. Now we're gonna come back up and go to align to artboard. That's usually the two that are selected. It's either aligned to selection or aligned to artboard as kind of your default when you open the program. So now if we come back up to center, you'll see once again, they have successfully centered to each other, but they've also centered to the artboard. So my light bulb moved. Now, if you're working on something completely symmetrical and you want it right in the center of your artboard, this is a good option. But again, I don't want that light bulb to move. So let's look at one more thing. A single click is gonna fix all this for us. Check it out. So control Z to put those back where they were. And again, select the brain, hold shift, select the light bulb, let go of everything. Now just click one more time on the object that you don't want to move. In this case, I want the brain to move, but not the light bulb. So one more click and you can see that light up. This has now uh, turned the light bulb into an anchor point. This thing will not move. And it's just one extra click after you've selected all the objects, just one more mouse click will anchor one of those so they don't move. Now, if we come back up and hit center, boom. Not only have my objects aligned to each other, the light bulb didn't move and that's what I was after. And it just takes that one extra click. Thanks for watching everyone. I'm Dan Bennett, the Antipreneur. This has been another hurry it up tutorial. I'm always trying to bring you guys just quick down and dirty tutorials to help you get the job done and keep the creative juices flowing. Again, thanks so much for watching. If you like this sort of thing, hit that subscribe button, click the bell and you'll never miss an episode. Stay creative everyone.